Next section of the profile that you might wish to complete is your education history and we don't really need to say an awful lot about this except one or two uh, points of housekeeping. Um, so to complete your education history uh, you scroll down to the necessary section in your uh, My CV tab and click on the add new button and the first thing to do is to import the institution or organization where you achieved uh, specific qualifications. So the most obvious one will be which school you attended. So we'll just click it, uh, we'll just put an example in here. Um, give it a location, so Manchester for, for example. Uh, you can give it a date from and a date to, so your date from, um, but you might select current if you're still there, uh, and a privacy, so we're gonna put that as private and click publish. That will then set up that school in your education history uh, and the next thing to do is to start to add your qualifications and this is where the first point comes into play. Um, you may be studying different subjects uh, so you might want to write the level to which you're studying so it might be GCSE, biology for example and you may not have taken your qualifications just yet and if that is the case then just put pending in the grade section uh, and click save. And you can begin to add all your subjects as, and, and grades here. Obviously, if you if you have achieved the qualification, you can you can put in the correct grade there. Um, if you are not studying to a particular level, so if you've not yet reached GCSE stage, then you can put in the year that you are currently at. So it might be year eight or year nine. Um, but you get the idea. Start to list the subjects that you are studying uh, and the grades you either potentially got or you're expecting. And you can put even if you if you've got expected grades, you can put A expected in brackets. Another, the second point I'd like to mention is that you might not necessarily just want to list school qualifications in here. You might want to put things like your exa uh, your music qualifications or coaching certificates or um, first day certificates, things along those lines. So don't just limit it to your school education, put other things in there as well.